OK, joined by Desi Farrell here at Crow Park after the uh, victory over Loud in the Allianz League. 16 points to 1-6, the final score here this afternoon. Desi, we'll start with the game itself. Uh, your reaction to the win here this afternoon? Yeah, look, at it's, um, it's good to get the victory. Uh, that was one of the objectives for us at the start of the year was to get back to Division 1 football and and that's been achieved now. Uh, we won't be clapping ourselves on the back just yet. Uh, there's... Um, some aspects of that performance weren't up to scratch. There were other some very pleasing aspects, you know, but there's still loads for us to do and loads to work on. Yeah, it's easy to qualify for the Division Two final. Obviously, winning promotion to Division One, one of your main objectives, objectives for the year. But also, it's easy to qualify for the Division Two final uh, next weekend against uh, Derry. Another uh, big test awaits there. Obviously, you played Derry only a few weeks ago. Yeah, and um, you know they're they're a great side. I've been building there for the past couple of seasons and um, were deserved winners I felt uh, when we played them um, a couple of weeks back and uh, it's it's just it's really good for us to get another competitive game as we face into the championship preparation. How important is it to get back into Division 1 as well for next year? Yeah, I think it's important. Um, you know, we were obviously very disappointed with our form last year in the league. Uh, we managed to change that around uh, come championship but um, we're, we're coming in with a, a little bit more uh, of a head of steam if you like this time round and uh, there's a bit more strength and depth in the squad as well. Some of those younger players you've saw today uh, doing really, really well. Uh, Darren Newcomb, Lorcan O'Dell, um, Ross McGarry, Tom Lahiff uh, gave us great impact. Um, so And then we got some game time into uh, some players who've been out injured for a while, um, Paddy Small and Paul Mannion. So, so yeah, look, at we're, we're pleased with wh where things are going, but do realise and very conscious that uh, there's a lot more to do and um, the gulf between Division 1 and Division 2 is speaks for itself and uh, we have worked to get up to speed for the championship. Great to see some familiar faces back in the panel as well today. We'll start with Stephen Cluxton. Um, not only just in, in terms of his experience alone is a massive boost I'm sure to the group to have him back in, in and around the panel. Yeah, look, Stephen has been one of the most talented goalkeepers the game has ever seen and um, while he's been away for a while, we've had a couple of goalkeeping injuries, Evan hasn't played any uh, football this season yet and is, wor is working hard to get back uh, to full fitness and hopefully will achieve that uh, through the championship campaign. Dave O'Hanlon has been doing really well um, since he stepped in and uh, very, very pleased with David's performance. Uh, but obviously we need cover there and Stephen has always said he'd be more than willing to give a dig out if the need arose and it has arisen and uh, we're delighted to have him in the mix. Yeah, not just Stephen today, obviously Paul Mannion and Paddy Small also making uh, their first appearances of the uh, season. How big is it to have those two players back as well? And again, just in time for the league final next week and the championship yeah, not too far away. You know, obviously it's um, the first proper football they've seen this season uh, with us and uh, uh, didn't know the two boys, they'll know that uh, there's a bit of sharpness and a bit of work to be done for them. But it's, it's great to get some minutes into them today and another week of training and uh, we'll see where we're at next week.